my captains, and welcome now to Tuesday. Thanks for logging in. Well, it's a two-part day. That's because the moon will be in two signs, and we have two ruling planets today, so it's kind of an abrupt difference between the beginning and the end of the day. As we start out, we're still sort of light casting. The moon is in Leo, so your emotions are focused on your trust and intimacy issues. Now, I think by chapter three of this transit, you're probably feeling pretty strong, pretty safe. You're probably very clear about what your boundaries are, and if not, you should be. Saturn is ruling the first half of the day. So today in the first half, I think you are sharp and clear and you want to define what those boundaries are, thus the strength. As the day progresses, the moon moves into Virgo and the sun will be ruled by Mars. This does two things. On the one hand, it's going to make you kind of spaced out. With the moon in Virgo for the second half of the day, you're going to be doing a lot of processing. This is a self-reflective transit where you're thinking about your feelings and you're pondering what you believe and how you're raised and does that fit into your overall equation. So no matter how sharp you are in the first half of the day, I'm saying you're going to feel a lot more spaced out and dull the second half of the day. Also, Mars will be ruling the day, so it means it'll be time to act on those decisions you made. So if you decided that you're going to lock your roommate out, go ahead and lock him out the second half of the day. Act on those new boundary decisions and it might make you a bit more hyperactive in your mind as well. One thing in mind, this is highly likely tied to boundaries in the career because Saturn and Mars themselves are actually in the sector of career right now for Capricorn. So some of these boundaries, some of this learning, some of this philosophy probably ties to early stages of career changes that you're making now that Saturn is well into Libra. All right, my captain, that's all I have for Tuesday. But I'm back tomorrow to talk about emotional clarity with the moon and Mercury. All that and more in 24. Live, love, be. So